All right. I'd like to make it clear that y'all are doing all the whole fast food cheer list wrong. Y'all are getting all your shit mixed up. You know, it's just, it's not working. All right. So basically, we got the S tier, the A tier, B tier, C tier, and D tier. I don't know why there's no F tier for some reason. Um, maybe there is, and I just don't see it. Uh, all right. Never mind. So we're going to start with Arby's. Arby's, uh, every time I eat it, I kind of get sick. Honestly, I don't really think the roast beef is really roast beef. It's kind of ass. I'm going to have to put it in D tier. Um, yeah. Burger King. Uh, Burger King is like the equivalent of, like, premium gas. Like, y you're paying extra for some for some good shit, you know? So, I'm going to have to get that with, with S tier. You know, I've never really had something from Burger King that, like, I never really, like, disliked. I mean, I thought their Whoppers were always good. Their chicken sandwiches are great. Uh, um, I know they got those new, like, bacon cheesy tater tots. I, I think those are pretty good, too. So, shit. Yeah, that's going in S tier. Little Caesars. Yeah, it's not good pizza, but it is cheap pizza. Um, I know they also do that whole once-a-year thing where they give out free pizzas, and you can't go wrong with that. So, I'm going to have to put that in B tier. Carl Jr. is an... Or Hardee's, uh, hmm, I'm trying to think of the one I've had, Carl Jr.'s. Oh, yes, I have. Um, it's okay. I've, I've had it once. I think I've maybe had, like, a burger and, like, I think it was, like, maybe a shake or something. But I don't think they're that bad. Pretty average. B tier. Chick-fil-A is ass. No questions asked. D tier. Uh, Chipotle is overrated. You know, well, Chipotle's not necessarily, uh, bad, but I wouldn't say it's necessarily, like, I, I don't think it's as good as everyone says it is, you know. You're always promised, to, uh, like, a new thing whenever you go there, when really, you've got, like, what, eight, eight selections to choose from, honestly. And also, your burritos are, like, what, like, 20 bucks almost, so it's, like, shit, C tier. Domino's Pizza, uh, let's see, good pizza, good breadsticks. Out of all, like, the pizza places in America, preferably, I would have to go to Domino's. Um, now, obviously, now, just, that's, that's just basically, like, fast food-wise. Uh, I, because I live in Chicago, uh, we got pizza places like Giordano's, uh, Lou Malnati's. Uh, you got all your, all your local shit, too. And honestly, that does kind of beat pretty much everything on this list. But in terms of fast food pizza, I'd probably say Domino's. Probably landslide uh, Pizza Hut, so I'll put that in the A tier. Dairy Queen, good ice cream, not good food, D tier. I don't know what this is supposed to be. Five Guys, I think. Uh, five Guys, I've had before. Um, very good burgers, very good fries, bunch of shit. You know, nothing too special. I'm gonna give it an A tier. In now Burger, um, I don't think I've actually had In now honestly. There's not real, I don't think there's really any, like, in and outs, like, around, like, where I live. So I kind of really can't decide. I'm going to have to just put this with B tier, because, you know. I, I don't, I'm, I'm going to say they're not, I'm going to say they're not ass, but i definitely say they're average. Jack in the Box, we don't have those around here. Well, actually, I think we do, at least, help in, like, driving distance, but shit. Uh, Carl Jr.'s B tier fucking. KFC, ass. McDonald's. <laughs> okay. McDonald's, you can't, you can't, you gotta be careful with this one, because, you know, McDonald's food isn't necessarily, isn't good food, okay? But, it's, it's, oh shit, I don't know how to describe it. <sighs> if you're broke like me, yes, go for McDonald's all the way, get the McChicken, get the fucking dollar, whatever, just, yeah, B tier. Panda Express. Mm, no one really else kind of does like chi good Chinese food, fast food wise. Um, every time I've had Panda Express, I've always enjoyed it, so I'm gonna have to give that an A tier. Really good chicken, really good uh, noodle bowls and everything. Oops. Uh, Papa John's. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he he has the N word pass or something like that. I don't know. Uh, D tier. Pizza Hut. Mm mm. Hmm. Well, like I said before, between Domino's and Pizza Hut, I would definitely choose Domino's. I think it's just fair, just just obvious. I would just put that around B tier. Popeyes. Okay. Um, 
I'm actually not too big of a Popeyes fan. If I had to choose fried chicken, I would actually choose Browns. Uh, that's not on the options here. Nevertheless, uh, Popeyes is still pretty good. Uh, pretty good fried chicken. Pretty good side dishes as well. I give it maybe an A tier. Sonic, um, yeah, I'd say that they're, they've got good options. Um, it, I, I don't know why, but every time I go there, there's always like a group of retards for some reason. Like, it, there's always just some sort of like group of people with massive discipline, like either ma massive mental impairment or some physical impairment. I swear to God, I don't know why it's like that. I think maybe I'm just like cursed whenever I go to Sonic or something like that. But food wise, though, um, they get, they get good shit. Um, good burgers I've had. Uh, their shakes are wonderful. Probably better than Steak and Shake. Um, I give it maybe an A tier. Subway, mm, sandwich company, not too special. Still good, but C tier. Taco Bell. I used to work here. You can smoke in a restaurant. Uh, Wendy's. Eh. 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 Wendy's has good deals, alright. They've got that whole, like, 4 for 4 thing going on, where it's, like, you can get, like, a good-ass four items for four bucks, where, like, so, like, a double burger, some nuggets, some fries, some drink. Um, they've also good, got great regular burgers. I will give, give uh, Wendy's this. If there's one thing I will say about Wendy's, is that they've always had good quality. Uh, their meat has always been very high quality. Um... Very, very juicy. Um, when they, when they, I've worked, I've worked at Wendy's before. And when they say that they never freeze their beef, that's that's actually true. We never, we never do. What we do is that we kind of keep it like refrigerated necessarily, which I guess in concept isn't too different. But um, yeah, in terms of quality, I definitely say Wendy's is certainly up there. I'm gonna give it with the, give them an A tier. And then we got White Castle. This is basically uh, Stoner Heaven. If you if you you have to go if you if you haven't gone to White Castle after you had like a massive smoke sesh you are you are not living your your life right. But um besides that I know White Castle there's one thing I love the most about it is when they release their um I don't know if they still do this but they have like a barbecue pork sandwich. Uh, I remember when that came out like almost a decade ago I had like I had like four of those with my aunt one time we went down there. Uh, it was it was good times. So I there's definitely some nostalgic value to it. Um, value and price, I'd say it's pretty fair. Um, I'd honestly say it's kind of S tier. I mean, no one really does their whole slider gang game uh, better than White Castle. You know, like they're pretty much the kings of what they do best. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, if you disagree with it, fuck you.